Arlo. Arlene. 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 Arlene, it's time to go. Wait, don't go. Please, don't leave me. Arlene! Hey kid, how'd you get back here? You're not supposed to be here. Hey boss, what do we do he knows? Arlene! 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 You realize what we have to do now, right kid? You brought this upon yourself. You need to start remembering to take your medication, or else you're going to keep hearing voices. Arlo. Ah, here he is. Just the boy I was looking for. What are you doing in here? I asked you to stay in the conference room. This is a restricted area. Did you forget what I came here for? Did you forget who I am? Know your place, doctor, or soon you won't be one. I'm not going to let you take him. Not like last time. Not like Arlene. 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 Why not? He's fully capable- It's different with him. He has no control. No, then we will teach him control. You can't control something that is uncontrollable. We have no choice. The girl was defective. She was overcome by her emotions. These are humans, not weapons. If you take him, you're going to have the same results. He won't be able to find it in him to kill someone. If that's the case, we'll have to put him down. Should be easy. I mean, we already had to do it with Arlene. 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 Grab the kid. Arlene. It's time to no, go. No, stop, please. Arlene. I'm begging you. Arlene. Don't take him. Arlene.